हेलो एंड वेलकम दिस इज हेना तलाटी एंड यू आर वाचिंग इट्स टुमारो न्यूज एज अ रिजल्ट ऑफ बिटर चिल फ्रॉम द बार्टिक अ ह्यूज सेक्शन ऑफ थेम्स फ्रोज ओवर एट साउथ वेस्ट लंडन इट्स नॉट ऑफन द थेम्स फ्रीजेज ओवर द साउथ वेस्ट लंडन द रेयर साइट ऑफ फ्रोजन थेम्स वॉज कैप्चर्ड बाय द लोकल पीपल द लार्ज सेक्शन ऑफ फ्रोजन रिवर इज इन द माउथ ऑफ ट्रेडिंगटन लॉक ऑन द नॉन टाइडल साइड here the water flows slower than the rest of the adjoining thames the thames has been completely frozen over in the past too between 1300 and 1850 britain was in the grip of little ice age the early 17th century to the beginning of 19th century the thames regularly froze over The last was in January 1963 the coldest winter for more than 200 years brought blizzards snow drifts and temperature of minus 20 degrees celsius at that time there were scenes including a man cycling on the thames near the windsor bridge people skated out outside the buckingham palace and a milkman delivered his round on skis as snow lay on the ground for 62 consecutive days between 1309 and 1814 during which britain was said to have experienced a little ice age the thames froze at at least 23 times at the time of first frost fair in 1608 the river froze over for 6 weeks london is likely to witness such a display again apart from the climate crisis the architecture of the thames has changed the new london bridge built in 1831 with fewer arches allow more sea water to pass up the river and the construction of the wall later in the 19th century narrowed the thames making the water fast flowing the river about addington lock has frozen before in recent times usually just above the lock gates but this has depended on the amount of boats coming through this year partly due to a pandemic there has been little river traffic so the lock gates have been opened less frequently in the capital and the southeast train services have been cancelled and roads have left in a dangerous conditions it was joked that agencies might have to use smallest boat to break the ice before the rescue crews could take to the water they might have to use the d class inflatable lifeboat as an ice breaker temperatures in the london has dropped to minus 2 degree celsius due to the extreme freeze the uk experienced the coldest february night of 25 years with temperatures dipping to below minus 20 degrees celsius in some parts of the country this week the temperature in the capital are expected to stay around 0 degrees celsius to minus 1 degrees celsius but one could feel as low as minus 5 degrees celsius due to the wind chill this week was the coldest february night across the uk since february 23 1955 the mercury plunged to minus 23 degrees celsius on wednesday night in some places making it the coldest temperature recorded in the uk since 1995 Overnight temperatures fell to low as minus 19 degrees Celsius in parts of the Scotland and freezing conditions are set to continue. Weather warnings remain in place for snow and ice with predictions of cold temperatures during the week. One yellow weather warning is in place for snow and ice covering the entire length of the country. It warns that snow showers and icy patches will strike the affected regions and people are advised to expect travel disturbances. In Scotland, low of minus 19 degree was recorded by the Met Office early this morning making it the coldest night so far. The forecast continues for cold weather ahead the sub zero conditions are not expected to be as extreme. Over the weekend the weather is expected to turn quite dangerous as an area of cloud and rain coupled with extremely cold weather brings further risk of snow and perhaps the freezing rains.
The bidding code has prompted responses from local councils in England with residents want to take extra care while the cold snap lasts. The NHS said that despite tough conditions, many vaccination centers had remained open and the missed appointments would be rescheduled. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Hena Talati. For more weather updates like this and please subscribe our channel.